Holy crap, that one actually scared me. <laughs> guys check it out i am still in niles ohio and i cannot pass up a chance to film another spirit halloween there it is i don't know what this was before spirit moved in but we're gonna find out spirit halloween all right let's go for it it's so much fun it's scary yes I love the sights and sounds, guys. Okay guys, so this was a Joanne Fabrics before they moved in. Let's look around. Okay, look at this. It's pretty much the same setup in all these spirit stores. But there might be a few different things. Like, I don't think either of them that I've been to so far had this guy. I don't know if there'd be a way to turn him up or not, but I can't really hear much of what he's saying. But we got Bubba over here, the dog that jumps out at us. Let me show you him again. <laughs> Look at that. Creepy! Alright, let's see. Oh, yeah, here's another one. See, somebody told me that this guy was supposed to be on the front of the boat at one of the other ones that I filmed. And uh, he wasn't, but I don't see the mat that you're supposed to step on. Hmm. He's creepy, but I don't see any kind of an animatronic thing with him, so I don't know if he's supposed to be moving or not. All right, let's move on here. Oh, here's the spider that jumps out. <laughs> Holy crap, that one actually scared me. <laughs> Look, this one actually jumps out of the boat. The one in, uh, in Canton, I think it was, he was set off to the side, and I'm not sure why, but this one actually scared the crap out of me when I stepped on a thing. We gotta do that again. <laughs> I love that thing. <laughs> All right, let's go through here again. Here's a scary guy in the porthole. All right, and this is what I'm seeing at all of these this year. This is the theme, is this, this pirate ship, like the haunted pirate ship, which I love. And I love this guy right here. <laughs> I could look at these a hundred times and it'll never get old. The bag of bones up there. And here we got the cocoon guy. I think that's all he does though, is just kinda wobble around. I wish he wobbled around like violently. That would be creepy. All right, so hold on. Here's this other guy. <laughs> he comes out for free hugs, but we got this little girl and I don't know what she's supposed to do. Because she didn't work in the other ones. Let's see if... That must be part of this guy. But I thought she was supposed to be electronic too. I guess not. Alright. Let's keep on moving here. Okay. Yeah, it looks like the same kind of costumes that are pretty much everywhere. I mean, in all the spirit stores. And I thought that you'd be able to watch this video online, but I got on the website the other night and it was not on there. So if you come into one of these stores, you can watch this and, uh, and see all the animatronics. That Yeah, that's the scary spider that just scared the crap out of me. And there's the dog. But you can come in here and you can watch these videos on here and see all the new animatronics. I haven't seen that guy anywhere. The one with the, uh, 
with the chainsaw there. Look, and a bucket of, uh, <laughs> holy crap, the bucket of organs. I don't think I've seen that guy set up anywhere either. Oh, that one either. This is cool. This one wasn't working in, in the other store that I was in. Here he comes. <laughs> I don't know that the head is supposed to be in that position, but... And I kind of thought that it would, like, jump out real fast. That's so weird. Okay. Hopefully with uh, YouTube's new copyright rules, I won't get a strike with this music playing in the back, but... Look at these babies here. These things crack me up, man. <laughs> little terrors. It could be a regular baby with no evil face and it would still be a little terror. <laughs> Look at those. Okay, wait a minute. I see cool stuff over here. Oh, look at this. This is awesome. Slimer pathway markers. Those are sweet. Oh, this one lights up and talks. Cool. Uh, let's see. Chucky. That's cool. A Chucky greeter. Michael Myers greeter. I think I saw that one in other stores, too. Sam. Here's their uh, animatronics that are for sale. Yeah, I thought this guy, I thought his face would, like, jump out real fast or something to scare the crap out of you. I think they have pretty much the same thing set up at all the stores. Because I've seen this also. Um, I was kind of hoping they'd have other animatronics, though. This guy's pretty loud, though. Everybody has good childhood memories of the Follow me. I promise we will give you some new memories you will never forget. <laughs> that was so stupid. Um, this guy reminds me of the waving clown on Pee-wee's Big Adventure when he gets his bike stolen. And he comes back and there's just like a little bit of the chain links laying around him. Okay, just in case you're from this area you have not seen my other videos, I'm going to go ahead and do these. Look at this. These girls are really creepy. Wait, how do I get them to move? These ones must... Those things are scary as crap. They must just be uh, motion activated, though. And this one I couldn't figure out the other day. You can see the, the jagged cut in her mouth, but I couldn't figure out like how you get her to actually do anything. Because she eventually talked to me in the other store, but... Alright, let's go through the uh, haunted house here, the Spirit Aquarium. Here we go. Look, we got the windows like it's an aquarium. And you'll see different things float by. Like, here's a diver. Oh, killed. Where's the... Here we go. Oh, guys, look at the fog. Look at the fog coming out. That's sweet. <laughs> in the other store, I couldn't figure out where it was coming from. It was blowing right in my face, but it stopped before I figured it out. It's all coming out of these right here. What's that, a puffer fish? Oh, yeah. They got it set up like it's like a museum or a zoo. Puffer fish, and then you'll see them right there swimming. Angler! Oh, I missed them. Angler fish. Piranha. The piranhas are what just ate the diver a minute ago. Oh, I see. This one's an octopus here. Okay, I don't know where he's at, but... And here we got the shark. He swims through this one. This is supposed to be like one giant shark tank along this wall. And he swims through here. And then when the music comes, that's when he smashes into this window here.
See, that's cool. They got it set up uh, with good timing where he smashes against the, the window and then all the smoke blows out, the fog. The other stores have like a black sheet though hanging over the door there. It looks like pretty much everything else is the same, just like the basic costumes. Ooh, vampire fangs. Oh, look at this, look at the cheap vampire fangs. That's hilarious, how much are these? 99 cents. Remember buying those things from like the gumball machines? And your saliva would get all in them and you'd be like, <laughs> that's so gross, oh my God. <laughs> All right, fake blood, demon blood, look at that. Oh my God, look, a banana hat. <laughs> Your face comes out there, holy crap. How much is that? I love that. $12.99, that's actually not bad. Banana face. This hard hat reminds me of Monsters, Inc. $23.19. Killer knives, axe, what's this? A trench knife. Worn cleaver. A rusty machete with a saw on it. Basic masks here. I've always thought this one was pretty creepy. Brother? <laughs> Look at this, guys. I like this one too, the scarecrow. And it looks, yeah, animation. So as you move your mouth, his mouth moves. That's pretty creepy. All right, look at guys. This is what I'm talking about, how every store has different stuff kind of hidden. This has got several different kinds of Michael Myers masks. So this is Halloween 2. They had that at the one store. They had Halloween 1, which I don't see. Maybe back here, but yeah, look at this. Here's Halloween 1. This is the most generic... <laughs> Michael Myers mask, although it's thick. It's thick quality, even thicker than these. But this would be the one from the brand new movie. Well, a couple years old, but that one's actually kind of hard to find. Hold on, I dropped one here. What is this? Michael Myers, The Beginning. I haven't seen this mask anywhere. Yeah, so look at this. I've got one, two, three, four, five different kinds of Michael Myers masks. And this one is probably the best one, best looking one of them all. That's from last year's uh, re remake of Halloween, I guess you could call it. I, it was good. I liked the movie, but it wasn't my favorite. I didn't like Jamie Lee Curtis's character in that movie. A lot of people are going to kill me for that, but I didn't. I liked H20 better. But that's just an example of how you can find different things at each different spirit several different ones there. I don't even know why they have regular music playing in these stores. It should all just be Halloween sounds and Halloween music and stuff. It all just adds to the uh, atmosphere though. Look at this. <laughs> Ouija mystifying mints. <laughs> I got little kids Ghostbuster outfits. Look at this little Stay Puffed. That is hilarious. And we got the little, it says Rookie. I thought, for a second I thought it said Vankman, but it says Rookie. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> little Kid's Nightmare Before Christmas. Thank you, have a good day. You too. Oh, look at this. Let's see if they have the one that I liked from the other store. Yeah, here it is, look at this. Pumpkin Bunting, that to me is so hilarious. Look at that baby, look at those chubby little cheeks. Holy crap. <laughs> Same with the Tiger Tot. Mischievous Monkey. Those are some really good outfits. Look at this one. This is like baby teen wolf. <laughs> All right, guys, I think we've pretty much covered the whole store, except for like just the little basics. But the cool stuff we definitely got. Color change ghost. No, well, he's turned on, but he's not working. All right, guys. Yeah, I think we got everything in here. If you live in the area, though, come down and check it out. Look, oh, look, I didn't see this before. What the? Hay bale popper? He jumps up? That would be cool. And I didn't see this one either. Victorian Guardian Gargoyle. Grim Tabletop Gargoyle. 
Okay, and yeah, here's Jack Straw. He's on the front of the boat up there. He's supposed to lunge up from a chair, but he's apparently not working or something. <laughs> Hanging Hell Fiend. <laughs> I hadn't seen that one either. <laughs> Fogging Skull Pile. Reaper Bust. Yeah, almost this whole pile here are ones that I haven't seen in the other stores. This is one of my favorite uh, costume. Wait a minute, look at this. What the heck? <laughs> okay, that's hilarious. This is one of my favorite costumes that I've been seeing, the inflatable wavy arms guy. That's pretty funny. I would totally wear that. All right, guys, let's roll out of here. I gotta hit the road. I got about an hour and a half drive ahead of me. I got a ton of other stuff to do today. But yeah, if you live in the area, come down here and check out this store. Spirit Halloween. Wait, what's this? What the heck? Look at his Sesame Street outfits. <laughs> Those are so awesome. <laughs> Anyways, this place is right across from Eastwood Mall. So come on down and check it out. Used to be Joanne Fabrics over here. I know somebody who would wear this every day of the week. Every day of the week, all year long. <laughs> Here's some more Michael Myers, The Beginning Masks. That is really a bad one. That, ugh. That is one of the worst Michael Myers masks I've ever seen. This, on the other hand, though, is a pretty dang good looking uh, Freddy Krueger. Usually, Freddy Kruegers are the bad ones. And look at this, guys. This is another version yet of the glove. Somebody's opened it. Hold on. That is a really good looking glove. I saw these at the other stores, this like real cheap one with the plastic bendy knives. Then this one, which is even better, it's like a deluxe, but I have not seen these anywhere. Supreme Edition Replica Metal Glove. It's made of metal, guys. You could really, never mind. The YouTube bots will get me if I say that. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm really out of here this time. That was fun, but I gotta go. Catch you later, peace.